And we're rolling right along into our next Muay Thai fight. We got Nastasia taking on Tony Rivera. Tremendous fight. We just had continuing the Muay Thai fights here. Love seeing right. these Muay Thai fights. And nice change of pace. I'm excited to see Tony Rivera throw on the big gloves here. Oh, I am too. Uh, I should have been wanting to do. He's been a dog and a half in all of his MMA fights, going for broke, and he's been caught in some submissions where, you know, he doesn't really get the opportunity to get the work in for his ground game. Yeah. So this has been a long time coming for Tony Ninja Star Rivera to nullify the ground game by throwing himself into a kickboxing fight. So no submissions uh, here. All in all, wants to throw the hands and show his knockout power and show his striking skills, and he's doing it against a much more experienced fighter in Zach Nastasia, who's sitting at one and one, fighting out of fight zone, Team True, uh, to uh, decorate a camp there. Yeah, I remember Rivera, when, um, hungry. when Rivera fought Joe Corrier, I specifically remember him talking to Joe at the beginning of the fight, saying, all right, let's entertain the crowd, let's fight, let's fight. And then Joe Corrier ended up submitting him. So, you know, I think it was a good, smart move for Rivera to go into uh, Muay oh, yeah. Thai and just work on his striking. Sounds like this is meant to be his bread and butter, like he's telling everybody, so I'm excited. Yeah, Rivera, like, uh, it might be a little bit of a delay here. Yeah. Oh, no, no, there he is. Rivera enjoys the moment big here time, too. When the cameras are in his face, he's smiling, looking at him, giving us a show. Loves to fight, man. He's uh, he even, though he's, even though he is uh, falling short in his past couple MMA fights, don't think that his attitude has been deterred. Because he's still as hungry as ever to get his feet wet and claim a win here in front of the Cage Titans crowd. Hey, he's soaking it in right now. And he's one of those guys, he just loves to fight, you know, and he loves uh, fighting here at K Shines. I remember at the last show after the show, uh, he came up to Mike and said, hey, what's next? When's my next one? You know, so this guy just loves to fight. He loves being here at K Shines. Looks like the, the legend, Zach Searle, is going to be in the corner for the first time tonight. Oh, my possible, possible future opponent of mine. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I'd pay to see that. We'll, we'll make it happen. Now, so it I'd can pay happen. big bucks We'll make that. it happen. Get it in the cage. I'm in. He won't sign. Maybe a returning fight? His two? Tell me he wouldn't pay. Come on. Yeah. <laughs> I told you I would. Or yep. Tony Rivera taking every moment of this walkout. O and O in the Muay Thai ring. The hell Still of a head of hair. First combat sports win but a dog and a half. All heart from Tony Rivera. Yeah. Just a tough, tough dude. And you know, a testament. Someone who admittedly hasn't put in the work on the ground, but still takes MMA fights anyways. And then it took a few losses for him to be like, you know what? I want to go in there and showcase my uh, ability to fight in a phone booth. Might as well do it in a pure stand-up sport. I've seen other fighters do that in the past. Mikey Albert being one of them. Took a couple of losses in the MMA ranks and then had a tremendous fight in the Muay Thai competition. Tony Rivera looking to follow those footsteps right here. It's always different to put on the bigger gloves. The shank guards, the elbow guards. Tony Rivera makes his inaugural walk to the cage. Titans cage as a Muay Thai competitor. Zach. Rocking the Wicked Muay Thai. USA shorts. Custom USA shorts, 4th of July weekend. Those are so slick, those shorts. Aren't they? Makes me upset I'm missing this fight night, but yeah, I'm happy to right. be here. You'd be all right as we await his opponent. Zach Nastasia, no stranger to the uh, to the Muay Thai arena, one and one at Muay Thai, making his inaugural Cage Titans walk though, sporting the Cage Titans tank top. And again, we didn't see any elbows in that last fight, but maybe this would be the one where you see some amateur elbows get thrown. Wouldn't be opposed.
He said he was one and one. Interesting. So this guy's experienced some Muay Thai. Hungry competitor, Steve Gaudet, Mike Chu in the corner. And this is a big moment. Even though Tony Rivera is making his debut, he's made this walk plenty of times. Oh, it's yeah. a different walk than walking into any cage of uh, any other venue at, right. this, at this level. It's... Oh, Tony Rivera is comfortable as comfortable can be right now. I mean, he looks like he's done this boatload. Oh, he's looking like he's fired up in there. And Zach Nastasia finalizing his walkout. Makes his inaugural cage side his walk. Here we go. Cameraman with the backward steps. Gotta love it as we wait our tail to that take. That was impressive. I'm not even gonna lie. Bell the tape here. Tony Rivera, the older man by 10 years. Nastasia has got a three inch, three, three inch advantage in the height. Rivera coming in at 148. Nastasia 156 and the reach just around the same. Hmm. And we'll give it off to Andy to get this thing underway. Ladies and gentlemen, prepare yourselves for the next fight of the evening. An amateur Muay Thai competition taking place at the lightweight division, scheduled for three rounds, two minutes apiece. Introducing to you first, standing in the red corner, Standing at five foot nine inches tall and weighing in at 148 pounds from Lemonster, Massachusetts. He's representing TNT Gym. And tonight he makes his Muay Thai debut. Let's hear it for Tony Ninja Star Rivera. And now, introducing his opponent, standing across from him in the blue corner, holding an amateur Muay Thai record of one victory and one defeat. He stands five feet, 11 inches tall, and he weighed in at 156 pounds. From Pembroke, Massachusetts, he's representing Fight Zone and Team True. Let's hear it for Zach. Nastasia! Ooh, Nastasia. And when the action begins, our referee in charge favorite. of this contest Probably is Alan Lau. All right, three two minute rounds here. Muay Thai action. Nastasia in the blue trunks. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. This is and Tony out. Rivera in the red. Here Very we go. interesting to see how this one's going to play out. Ooh, heavy kick to start it off. Jesus. Just misses. Oh, he's, <laughs> he's talking Rivera, to him already. He's already. The southpaw. Nice body shot from Rivera. Set it up with the jab. Stage is just tracking him down. Yeah. Nice body kick from Rivera. Rivera throwing heavy kick. Both guys throwing kicks there. Left hand down the pipe for Rivera. Nastasia just stalking him. Oh, trying to go upstairs with a kick. Rivera moving the head, slipping and moving. Rivera's got to be careful dipping too low with that there head, though. Oh, nice there's another one. He's hurt. He He's down. The... Oh, and that's going to be a count. God. Picture. What a kick. Perfect. Lever, lever kick. kick. That's the southpaw lever kick. And that's the second this one. This is going to be it. He might be done. This is it. No, he's getting up. He oh, got a standing eight maybe count. Maybe not. What a kick by Tony Rivera. That's the Rivera. second one that he's landed this fight. Yeah. And there's, oh, a, and there's a, you, a three knockdown rule per round, four per fight in Muay Thai. Right. 
Rivera knows that that rear kick is money in the bank, and he's just got to time another one. Now, but that is right to the liver. Now, that also automatically makes this a 10-8 round. It, it, yeah. Oh, yeah? Now, Nastasia has to earn back a 10-9 loss round. He's got to dominate the rest of the round to get a 10-9, but this should be by the books yep. around for Tony Rivera based off of the knockdown. And it, it should technically be a 10-8. It is a 10-8. A knockdown's be. a 10-8. Yeah. Wow. It's a totally different sport, Muay Thai, yep. mixed martial arts. That was, no and it was out of nowhere. And, and it was so clean. It, was a, it wasn't out of nowhere. He set it up and landed right, right, it earlier right. and was going to it, but the second one was just, and the delayed the reaction, power. too. I know. You saw it. Those the are the worst took ones. One step back and immediately, uh, not immediately, but a split second delay, slow motion curling. My liver's been through the worst oh. of it all. I've drank myself up 100 pounds heavier, and that is the worst pain that you could ever experience in a combat sports fight is a shot directly to the liver. That'll shock anybody's system. It definitely is. It could shut your body down immediately, but you know what? He got back up, and then he was chucking head kicks right after and stuff like that, so I think he might be recovered. Yeah. Very well could be recovered, but Rivera's got to know that that is a target he's got to find again. Yeah. Yep. Yep. And Nastasia, he's got to know that he is down by a 10-8 round, and even if he wins the next two rounds, it's only a draw. Right. He's got to do oh, some serious man, damage. Bro. Yep. He's got to get in the horse. You know, and Nastasia, up until that point, Nastasia was looking real confident. He was he was coming forward. What is he doing? What's going on? Maybe some spilled ice or something? Or? Uh, uh, they'll tell me we're going to have an ice situation. Got water. Uh, just some water. What did Jack Searle do? Uh -huh. All right, the ring is dry. All right, we're good. Let's get this action going. What All a right. round that was, though, between Tony Rivera and Zach Nastasia. Nastasia ready to go. He knows he's got to get this round back. Rivera just showing some respect to Nastasia's corner. Nastasia trying to throw that left kick to the body of his own. Ooh, trying to go with some spinny stuff there, but doesn't throw anything. There's that liver kick yep. again. That left the kick, it's dangerous, and the stage has got to be ready and he's for it. The punches to the oh! oh! Well, there's that knockdown talking about got to do something big. Oh, 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 oh. That was big. Ow, I felt that one. Oh, boy. Right on the jaw. These guys are just dropping each other with kicks. We got ourselves a fight. We yeah. got ourselves oh, a fight. Man. What a fight this is. I been. mean, that's the beauty of Muay Thai. They <laughs> have to fight on their feet. Oh, Rivera's got to come back now. And that was a great setup with that head kick from the stage. You're throwing yeah. it behind the rear hand. Oh, there's that left Ooh. kick again. These guys. They're shocking him. Yep. I love it. Now, let's see. Ooh. Oh! oh! The toes caught him. That one hurt him. That was bad. Yo, he, he, leaned, he leaned back almost out of the way, almost matrix style, but the toes caught him oh, right man. on the tip of the chin. It's and all over. Oh, Alan it's all over. going to call it. Ooh. Alan Lau's gonna call it. He you looked know. like he was ready for it. There is a three knockdown rule. In yeah, that the was round. only two. So he must have seen something in the looks of Tony Rivera right. that forced him to call it. But you know, Rivera's with the amateurs, not happy about it. No. I, I mean, there's a three knockdown rule at the round right. for a reason. So for my money, go ahead, finish the count, let him get knocked down a third time if I mean, he wants to. Right. But I don't disagree with the referee's discretion. He's got the best seat in the house. That's the t second head kick that got him. And like you said, that was a bad one. That was. The he, toes he went down hard. Caught him right on the chin, and the head didn't hit the back of the mat. He kind of like came to as he was going down, embraced the fall. But still, the referee's got the best angle. He must have seen something he didn't like in the eyes. Uh, three knockdowns in the course of two rounds. What a fight, though. What I mean, a fight. Nastasia getting dropped in the first round. Coming back in the second like that, unbelievable. What a fight. Rivera looks good, though, with that body kick. You know I know. Mean? Like, I mean, he was finding that home even in the second round a little bit, too. And yeah. You man, know, and those head kicks were vicious, though. I saw Rivera's oh, hands get a little too loose defensively, too. And right, right. He found that home. And, um, you know, I'd like to see Tony Rivera give it another shot in the Muay oh, Thai. Yeah. You also got to remember, he's going up a weight class. Yeah, you he know, came in light. Exactly, he came in light. You know, he could fight at 45, 40. So we'll see what happens in the future. Ladies and gentlemen, keep the noise going for these two.
Referee Alan Lau has called a stop to this contest at 47 seconds of round number two. Giving you your winner by TKO, Zach Nastasia.